When we began the puffin project, the prevailing attitude was let nature take its course. If puffins had disappeared, well, that's too bad, but why should we bother to bring them back? I felt that it was important to bring them back because people had caused them to disappear. The habitat was still good. Why not bring the puffins back to a place where people made them disappear? And that's what we set about doing. I was on Eastern Egg Rock on the 4th of July, 1981. I was scanning the south end of the island, and all of a sudden I spotted a puffin fly into my field of view of the scope, and there were fish in its beak. It ran, hopped, scrambled down under the boulders. It disappeared, and in a minute, it came up without the fish. That was the sighting we were waiting for. That was a sighting that we had almost hesitated to talk about for eight years, but there it was. It was real. Puffins were nesting once again after 100 years of absence on Eastern Egg Rock. I believe that people have the responsibility of being the stewards of life on Earth. Because there are so many people and we affect the planet in so many ways, we also have to affect it in positive ways to make sure that no species are lost. That we should pass along from one human generation to the next. Every species of plant and animal that lives on this earth. If we fail at that, then future generations will inherit a poor and a less interesting planet to live on.